didn't hit at all. So here I'm just distracting them in order to uh, save uh, Nidalee. And Nidalee should have been out by now. Unfortunately, she didn't get out. So I do get a kill here. And then uh, Nidalee should have just ran out there. I think she stopped for a while to check uh, if we could kill someone, but she should have ran out, e well, immediately. She was way too low. And then uh, the Nocturne still had vision of her and could ult on her. And that's a shame. So my team is doing pretty well. And as I say that, someone dies. <laughs> but we get the revenge kill as well. So we're dominating our lane here. And if Nidalee wasn't uh, hitting all the creeps, then we would outlevel them by a lot. But as it is, we just have far more gold than they do. Which means we're still winning the lane, but not by as much. Uh, here, this is one of those uh, cases that you should take advantage of the fact that there's an XP range. I'm still getting XP, uh, Nidalee is getting XP, but since there are now all the, the minions are now uh, at the tower, we cannot uh, keep the, the enemy opponents from or the enemy opponents, the enemy champions, from uh, gaining experience. This is one of those cases when it's quite easy to accomplish. But yeah, Nidalee wants to have all the last hits herself. And that's a shame. We could have had them at level 4 while we were at level 7. Almost 8 now. Yeah, now the enemy Nocturne is already level 8, and we're still level 7. So mid is getting owned a little bit, but uh, fortunately the uh, top lane is paying attention. Yeah, and even though he paid attention, <laughs> he still got killed. So I'm trying to uh, catch him behind the turrets. But of course he's gone. So I go back and decide that Nidalee can handle the lane pretty well by herself. And we lose turrets. So I don't get an actual clear shot of Nocturne. I'm still going to try to uh, to grab him. Unfortunately, I'm not very good at doing that. So Timo uh, is probably one of the people who don't play a lot of Timo. 
because he places mushrooms much too close to each other. It works out perfectly in this case because uh, Yi and Blitzcrank each hit the mushroom. But normally it wouldn't have been a very good positioning of the mushrooms. And uh, on top of that, the uh, mushrooms get killed by the minions. So we go one for one here, I think. really low here so I should really be careful as you can see all the mushrooms have been taken out by the minions and that's not a good way to uh, use the mushrooms so this uh, nocturne comes in and decides to 3v1 their team or 1v3 I should say they were all pretty low so it's a I guess a good decision, why not? And I'm buying another mana crystal because more mana is a bigger shield when I'm almost dead. And that's good. So nobody died in mid, even though uh, Nocturne really tried. So nobody's bottom lane now, and I'm just going to farm. Didn't work as well as I had hoped, but uh, I can still get most of the last hits. Unfortunately, I missed the cannon one, which is the most expensive one, or, well, it gives you the mo most gold. So I decide to just go jungling, because I don't want to get ganked. Not that there's a lot of uh, risk uh, for that, but... Yeah, still, I don't want to risk it. So Lux is pushing top lane, uh, with two champions surrounding her. I don't know where Teemo is going, but... There should be two versus, uh, versus one. And now she might actually get away. So nothing to do in the mid lane, um, the champions ran off and uh, yeah, I couldn't, ca I couldn't ca grab one. Here I almost grabbed Cartus but he's paying attention so he can just run behind the turret. And I'm going bottom. To scare away this uh, Nocturne. Nocturne is quite good at taking down turrets. So you cannot actually leave him in the lane with no uh, with no one uh, uh, threatening to kill him. Of course I missed the grab once again. So we see someone coming up the river, or down the river. So we do get the kill off here, which seems obvious, since <laughs> it's four against one. And yeah, well, we're just going to push this turret now. So Nocturne jumped on the enemy Nocturne. And uh, yeah, well, didn't actually need any help from anyone. He's uh, quite fat already. And it's going to get a lot better even. So we get a turret. And it's time to go back. Or to get dragon. 
yeah, nobody's coming for dragon, so it would be really helpful if uh, if they came here. So I get some uh, some help from Nocturne. Unfortunately, uh, Shaco gets killed at this moment. Nothing I could help, but still. Apparently we're really slow at getting uh, Dragon. <laughs> 